Hi, my name is Laura Cox. I am Shield Healthcare's ostomy lifestyle specialist. Today we're going to be talking about body image with an ostomy bag. Having an ostomy definitely changes your perception of your own body because not only um, did you have a disease that was life-threatening that affected your body, but now your anatomy is literally rearranged. Your first accomplishment when you are a kid is to be potty trained, to have control over your bowels and, and um, your bladder, and that immediately is taken away. Just the idea of losing that first accomplishment, it can be challenging. No matter what age someone gets an ostomy pouch at, it can be a difficult change. Teenagers who are still very flexible and very resilient are so worried about how your peers perceive you and you're very concentrated on not only the bodily changes that have happened due to surgery, but just naturally becoming a, an adult. The older demographic who also get ostomy pouches, it's such a huge game changer. I think that you already have a way you like to dress and you have a sense of self. There are also concerns like, will my partner, my significant other, my husband, my wife find me attractive still? No matter what age people get their ostomy, uh, there are unique challenges, but all of those challenges can be worked through. Being a 19 year old who was in the dating world, I was worried that I wouldn't be attractive to people. I was worried that this pouch would scare my soulmate off. And um, the fact of the matter is, is that it, it's a lot less scary than I thought it would be. And the person that I really had to make sure was okay with my pouch was me. I've never had a negative reaction from a significant other about my ostomy. And I think a big part of that has to do with the way that I present it, which is it saved my life and without it, I wouldn't be here. How I accepted how my body looked with an ostomy pouch was basically just to, um, one, appreciate that it still functioned like a normal body in a lot of ways, but two, I think that um, I started exercising a lot. I started to um, physically challenge myself. I started running races. I started lifting weights pretty seriously. And that was me showing myself that I could still do these really amazing things and that my body was not broken and that my body was still my home. The first time I went swimming after I got my ostomy, I wore a bikini to um, the hot tub at the gym and I was pretty nervous. I actually think I was shaking when I walked out and um, and kind of my fears were realized. I looked around, there was just one other couple in the hot tub and they were on the other side of the hot tub and, and this girl, I overheard her whisper to her boyfriend, what is that? And um, I remember for years afterwards, I wore one pieces. Recently I have been wearing two pieces again and, and being more confident, but Really, on days that I just want to enjoy my beach time, when I want to swim, when I want to just relax, I do wear those one pieces and that's because I don't want to feel like I have to explain myself to people. Ten days before my ostomy surgery was scheduled, I decided, I was 19 at the time, that I wanted to wear the tightest dress that I owned because I didn't think that I'd be able to wear tight things after ostomy surgery. Um, and go out dancing with some girlfriends. It was kind of part of my mourning process that, you know, I'm saying goodbye to this 19 year old girl who has a cute small waist and can wear these things. So I was going through my closet uh, very recently and my ostomy surgery has been almost five years ago now and um, I found that dress. Right after surgery, I wouldn't have put it on. I don't think I would have even tried. Putting on that dress and, and looking in the mirror and not seeing a trace of my ostomy bag, it felt like I was taking back a part of me that I thought I had lost, but I never really did. 